Hello and welcome back to Frog Boy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today we are going to be doing a benchmark with Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart on the RX 78 or 7900 XT running with the 5800X. Now we are going to be running this with the full on let's just get into the settings. Uh, we are running this with high level of D of everything we got ray tracing very high everything <coughs> object range set to 10 everything's still maxed out very 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 high ultra and high so that's basically what that all is looking like now if we can just get on over here to display we are running this at 4k we are going to off that stuff all right, I apply changes. I was trying to turn it off before I got in here, but okay. So as you can see, everything's set up. We're not trying to game the system or do anything else. We are gonna see what the actual frame rate is with ray tracing on Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart on the 7900 XT. We'll do, we're just gonna go up to a little bit past the ratchet thing we're not gonna we're gonna do some of the gameplay too Ooh, look at all the rays being traced it will be fun Wow, just look at the... <coughs> look at how much ray tracing just tanks your performance. Absolutely looks great, but absolutely useless if you want to play a game. Twenty-eight frames a second. Ooh. Hey, well, at least we got ray tracing now. I mean, we can also try it at the uh, at the ray tracing being down to. Uh, can also try it with the ray tracing uh, with the object range set to six. We'll, we'll give that a shot as well. So I'll just do like in succession, you know, we'll get to the ratchet part. We'll look at the, we'll look at that platform real quick. And then is what we'll do is we'll just do it again. And then we'll come back with FSR 2, 2.1 quality or whatever and see if that will help this out at all just me uh, because technically this is definitely not really playable so I mean that's just that's just pointless to even try to turn on ray tracing I mean it looks good like you can definitely see that the shadow ray tracing and all of that stuff definitely helps it does um, it does make the image really stand out a lot more but I mean you're borderline freaking playable unplayable so does it really matter at the end of the day oh wait i never put this back on a fast ssd either <laughs> this is still running on uh dude this is still running on my uh sata oh no maybe that's i wonder if that has anything to do with maybe that's taken off some performance i mean look how much vram we're at 18 we're, at, we're we're almost at 20 gigs of VRAM. Right. Well, um, 15 gigs of VRAM. Ooh, dang, man. Sorry about your uh, 4080. Dang, that sucks. Freak, look at that. <coughs> 15851. <coughs> Ratchet and Clank, a freaking little corridor game. I mean, that looks absolutely incredible, though. <laughs> Wow, look at that frame rate. Yeah, dude, we're in the 20s. All right, so let's uh, 
let's quit out of here. We'll just go back to that. Oh, man, I should have went and checked out, like, the, the thing and stuff. Okay, so, gosh, let me delete some of these. We'll just get right into there, Rebel. Okay, we're going to go into settings. Display. And now we are going to do... Uh, let's do the... <clears throat> Let's set this back to six. How about that? How about that? And let's see how... Uh, you know what? Let's just do the, the AMD FSR quality. Let's apply that. Let's just do this. Because, I mean... Let, let's just see. Let's just see what it does. Alright, well, we're uh, treading a 60 FPS line. There's a couple of heavy spots here, so... <clears throat> I mean, if you could play through this game... It <clears throat> well, that's a fairly heavy spot. Sorry about the coffin, I just got off work and I don't have anything to drink. Firmly. Oh, dang, we're into the 40s now. Wow. Oh, man, I hope this isn't, like, super loud. And now shadow ray tracing does look really good. Hey, it's okay. See? Just Still at freaking 16 gigs of VRAM. <laughs> oh my god. That's so bad. Curious. I'm going to have to find out if the 4080 is running at 16 gigs of VRAM too. Because that is madness. Oh boy. <laughs> Don't you think it's weird to throw a celebration for us? I mean... We haven't done anything heroic in years. What if everyone thinks we're washed up? <gasps> what if we are washed up? Luckily, we will not need oh, to perform there any go. Now Ratchet's actually got Unless some ray tracing going on. Those right. look nice. This time we'll we'll stay in this little area for just a second longer than what we did, and we'll kind of look at like the grass and the bushes and stuff and. I mean, with the ray tracing, with the shadows and all of that stuff, and, and like the the the, um, the reflections, it does kind of make the image pop a little more if if that's like something that you really want. But I mean, you also have to like balance that between between like performance and stuff. If your experience is going to be 47, 45 frames per second, that that to me like uh, that's not worth it. It's not worth playing that. Hey, this is a 
I mean, this does look. Even after all of these years, oh, I like the, the things are fixed. Yeah, it is, huh? Okay, so let's see what here. Let's see right here what we need to actually do to get this playable at 60 frames a second. Uh, we can turn that off. We can hit. 1440p and let's see what that looks like wow even 1440p is not going to get us 60 that doesn't make sense Displaying graphics. Yeah, I switched it. Okay, so 4K. Um, balanced. I don't even think it's... I don't, I don't feel like it's doing anything to change... I don't think it's doing anything. I don't think it's doing anything now. Turn off V-Sync. Performance. Okay, so turning off V-Sync and going to performance. Let's see something. Settings. Look at that. Yeah, this game's obviously got some Okay, so it's, it seems like turning off V-Sync clawed us, uh, got us, got us a few frames. Got us some actual freaking measurable frames. So now I think probably we should be able to go to balanced. And <coughs> Dude, I'm going to break this game. Look at this. So balance without V-Sync can get us into the 60s. I mean, if you've got to have 4K and you've got to have freaking ray tracing at the highest quality level on a 7900 XT. All right, let's play. Let's play the. Let's play through this this first part real quick. We're at balanced, and let's let's see how the let's see how the playable frame rate is. We'll play play through all the balloons and stuff like the first platform area oh, dear. <sighs> try to keep this video around 20 minutes because these 4k videos take forever to upload and I still got other games to work on so this one here is just not as important let's try to get some nonsense going on here Maybe try to look at some of it. I mean, the cutscenes tend to seem to be doing a lot better overall, you know, image-wise. But, like, gameplay? Dude, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, obviously, this is not that great of a performance for, you know, ray tracing. For sure. I, I, I feel like you should be over 60 frames a second. And well, I don't know, man. I don't. I don't know. Should should we? It, should it be necessary to use upscalers with ray tracing? I don't know. I, I don't know, man. I'm kind of feeling like I'm kind of feeling like maybe no. Kind of feeling like it. It, it sucks to have to use. 
I mean, if they're gonna sell us this stuff, man, we shouldn't be. We shouldn't. I, I don't know. We, we have to pay all that money for this to use ray tracing. Oh yeah, I can get some some more things if I shoot those. Yeah, nuts and bolts. Nuts and bolts. We can get nuts and bolts. All right, let's go. I mean, so far this is easily playable. I don't. I might. My uh, frame rate might be affected by the um, by having this on my SATA drive too. I don't know. Balanced mode is getting us. I mean, I kind of do feel like this this would be playable for the most part. I mean, I played through the whole game on PS5 at 30 frames a set. Or, uh, oh no, I played on the 60 mode without ray tracing, without anything. So, all right, my friends. Well, that's basically it. If you guys like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one.